Hey y'all, this is Jessica at Casa Magnolia and today I'm going to show you what I got for my two-year-old daughter's Easter basket. So I did this video last year when she was one years old and um, I will link that video down below if you're shopping for a one-year-old girl. But this year she will have just turned two when Easter comes around. So I will show you what I put in her basket. Um, first, this is the same basket I used last year. I got this, I'm sure it's from like TJ Maxx or something. Um, I got this as a gift for my baby shower and next year I'm going to get like a personalized basket, but we're going to have two little girls next year and I want them to match. So I'm waiting until next year to get like the real life Easter basket. So I'm using this this year. Um, I did get this purple grass because I forgot I had gotten grass last year and saved it. And did y'all know that they have like jelly bean smelling grass now? It's insane. So, okay, let's get started after I can stop stamping grass. All right, so most of the stuff, mm, pretty much all of the stuff I got at Walmart on the Easter section. Um, I didn't want to have a whole lot of candy because she doesn't really eat candy and she has no business eating candy so here we go um first off is a 98 cent 40 piece sticker pack with like spring and easter stickers this was in the easter section she is obsessed with stickers and these are like the puffy stickers so i thought these would be easier for her to pull off um so i know she's gonna love those and i'm sure i'll find them all over my house so that'll be fun for me. Uh, these are Animal Farm finger puppets. This was in the baby section by like the baby potties, baby bath toys, stuff like that. Um, she has she has some of the little like squeaky toy kind of bath toys that I got her not this past Christmas, but her first Christmas. And they're getting like pretty nasty inside. So I don't. I mean, I'm going to try and like disinfect them, but there's like nasty crap in there. So I was hoping that these will stay a little cleaner. And if you saw Sarah from Work Life Glue, she put these in one of her daughter's Easter basket. And she said that both of her kids love them. So um, I got these to try. The next thing is, it's like an activity kit. It says springtime sticker face. So basically it's like a bunch of stickers, but um, let me show you, you're putting the faces on like bunnies and stuff. So faces, sunglasses, again, she loves stickers. And then we can kind of talk about like, you know, hats, glasses, stuff like that. Okay, the next two things. are um, outdoor toys. This was liquid sidewalk chalk and it's like a powder that you add water to and then it has a little stamper. Um, they had regular sidewalk chalk too, but I don't know, I thought this would like, I'm afraid she's gonna break the sidewalk chalk and just like, it'll go to waste, but I don't know. I thought she could start with this. And then these are Fubbles. Um, my friend told me about these because she had gotten one as a gift for her daughter. So the good thing about the Fubbles is that this thing is like completely like screwed on there and then you just dip the thing so she they can't knock it over and spill all the bubble juice out in like two seconds. Um, they had one, they had some that had one dipper and some that had three dippers. So this is one of the one dipper ones. Um, I'm excited to use this because again, she won't dump it out. She thinks it's like water and she just slings it everywhere. So anyway, she loves bubbles too. Um, they, let's see, I did get one candy item. It's just an M&M's, pastel M&M's. I'm sure she'll have like two and my husband and I will eat the rest, but there you go. The rest is bath stuff. Um, this is an expanding magic towel. It's Fancy Nancy because she loves Fancy Nancy or ooh la la as she calls her. Um, 
so it's one of those ones that you get wet and then it gets big. Um, we keep towels in the back of her high chair for wiping off her, um, for wiping off her hands and mouth and stuff after we eat. I just keep like one towel out. And so she got some of these from my grandma for Valentine's Day and she was like really loving it. She loves the ones with Minnie Mouse and Fancy Nancy and stuff. They had a bunch of other characters at Walmart. They're in the Easter section if you're looking for them. But um, I know Dollar Tree has some of these as well, but we got the Fancy Nancy one. This is Fizzy Tub Colors, the Sesame Street, like Fizzy Tub Colors. This I think was 98 cents and there's three, I'm sorry, nine bright water coloring tablets. So um, my friend had these at her house and um, Evelyn really liked it in her bath water. I only got, there's a way bigger pack than this. I only got like the sample pack because I'm afraid it's going to ruin my tub. I know that's crazy. They obviously wouldn't sell it if it was like going to ruin your bathtub. But, um, so I'm just going to try one or two because I don't know. I'm so scared. But anyway, she really liked them. And so we're going to try this. Then this is the last thing. Um, it's by Crayola. It's bath slime. And it's like a glittery slime. It says cherry berry scented soap. So she's never had anything like this. I don't know if she'll like it, but we'll see. I mean, she likes anything that's like Play-Doh or stuff to do with your hands. So I think she'll like it and have fun with it. Um, but that's pretty much all I put in her uh, Easter basket this year. Again, not a lot of candy. I mean, she doesn't really need candy um but if I think of any other ideas I'll kind of post them in the description box below and again last year's video for the one-year-old girl will be down in the description box below if you're interested in that if you have a two-year-old this year uh leave me a comment so I know what you put in their Easter basket because I still have some time to go shop if you have any great ideas. Um, if you liked this video, you can give it a thumbs up or again, leave me a comment down below. So I know you like these kind of like uh, kids shopping or haul videos type stuff like that. And I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.